afternoon everybody this is NCP I've been messing with the Raspberry Pi cam remote cam for a while now and what I want to do I originally planned to do I may or may not do now but originally planned is I was gonna hook a webcam up to it and stream the aquarium live but there was just so many problems with that I tried rewriting code etc etc too many problems so I went down on Amazon, I bought a camera, uh, a Raspberry Pi camera, and um, basically this is about, I don't know, around $15, and because the reason I did is dealt with latency, let, let, because the reason I did it dealt with latency of the camera. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to show you how to set it up from scratch. Now... On my website, I'll put a file where you can just download it, and you'll be able to stream you live stream to YouTube, or you know um, any other RTMP service like UStream or whatever. Um, <clears throat> let's say you want to make like an Eagle Cam, like C. You could do that. Now, basically, you just put with the power pack here, and I'll show you how to activate it from my phone or your phone or any. Uh, any type of uh, terminal interface, but Android phones for easy. But if, let's say you're going to go out, and you want to do something, and you're going to maybe a hostile situation, like you're reporting on some event, and there might be hostile protesters there. Now, if someone, you could just use your cell phone, and a lot of people do. But let's say I get in some type of a threat or altercation. And someone slaps it out of my hand or steals it and runs away or whatever. Now, my theory is I would much rather lose a $35 unit that live streams than an $800 cell phone. Um, and you can even go cheaper if you get the Raspberry Pi Zero when that was a camera. So you're looking at a, about, a, uh, about a $15 or $20 solution to this. So, you can start up your phone, put your phone in your pocket, and let your phone do your remote network or Wi-Fi, <clears throat> or, you know, Tether or Hotspot or however you want. If there's free, free Wi-Fi, then use that. But either way, you can slap this out of my hand, I could drop it in a river, I could do whatever, and I'm only out a couple bucks. Okay? I could keep the phone in a waterproof Ziploc bag and still have the HD video through here. So... That's one of the reasons I'm doing it. Like I said, I'm probably not going to do the aquarium. Um, I might live stream other events, but uh, basically I don't have the right lens for this. I'd need a wide-angle lens or a fisheye or something. Otherwise, I have to have it out about two feet from the aquarium to, to actually see everything. And uh, the co there'll be a little code you can enter and just go. Just live stream or hit one button on your phone or however. We'll get into that in a bit, but... I'm going to make it here, I'm going to do it and set it up, and then you can just download the image off my website if you want, and just plug it in and you're good to go, just like that. You'll have to enter your own stream key, but other than that, you'll be good to go. So, let's go ahead and do this from the very beginning. Um, the Raspberry Pi 3s have a built-in um, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and all that. I will have to use a Wi-Fi uh, dongle, but... That's neither here nor there for right now. We're going to set it up with the, uh, the cable because I don't want to enter my uh, passwords and stuff in an image. So, there we go. Uh, let me get over here. Let me get to it. Um, you won't see this right now in the beginning so I'm just going to, I'm going to use the um, Ethernet and plug it right in like that for right now. But I'm going to go ahead and do some screen capture while I set it up. And you'll just enter the commands one after another. And I'll show you how it's done. Or like I said, you can just download the image, pop it in, put it in your card, pop it in. I've got several videos on burning an image for Raspberry Pi to an, a micro SD card. So I won't be showing that part over again. But let, let's get to this here and I'll, I'll we'll just cut to the computer over here and we'll get right to it. <laughs> 